So, Jordan Weaver, second highest qualifier. I can tell you now that her mum is standing just behind us. And she's rocking to and fro with her hands clasped below her chin. Look at the power. Two and a half twists. Almost overcooked it. Having back the highest score on vault. The current leader over to Bars. Jordan Weber. Forward clear circle, very difficult skill. Lovely transfer. Oh, she lost shape there. Very expensive to lose the straight body shape. She's got to hit every handstand from here on in. Catch up just a little bit lacking in rotation. Had to work hard in the upstart to keep it going. Winding up, double layup, beautifully done though. It's a 6-3 difficulty, uh, but there were quite serious errors right now. She needs a 15.7 to take the lead. Currently the highest score is come over with 15.4. Tip for the top here. Well, I think she'll feel much more encouraged after seeing the errors from the other gymnasts. The door is open to fight back. The one-handed flip into the layout somersault. Good height on the leap, good commitment to join the leap to the pike back somersault. She hovers in the air, she's so powerful. Side somersault, great precision. Leg well held. Another good leap. The quarter turn. The free cartwheel. But she does an enormously difficult skill right at the end here. Just watch this. This is nearly at the end of the routine. The full twisting, tuck back into the backflip. She's really harnessed her concentration giving it every bit of fight here she needs all this power plants her feet on the beam two and a half twist just a little pace back but that was a really gritty fight back totally focused on a medal 15.266 now we have a competition she's gone into second Last chance of a medal here. Beautiful double twisting, double back. She'll be out to beat that score. One and a half full count, very smooth into the triple twist. Clean triple spin. Good control on that series of leaps. Good split as well. Two and a half, punch run, just a step out. She was a tiny bit offline. into this last big double pike that was much more like it well gave away just that point one for a step out but all in all she's really fought back well well the score she needs to medal is 14.016 I thought she could do that yeah. I would be surprised if not Terrific height, look at that, double-double.
not phased at all and by the pressure on it to try and get enough marks to grab the gold medal at the last minute. That pace out could be expensive though. And she's looking anxiously, the first time we've seen smile and relaxation. Oh! Well, 14.333. She's gone into second, just 0.033 behind Weber. And you know, it will have been that fall out of the double spin, the spin with her leg up. They will have counted that as a fall, I think. Otherwise, why else that score? Well, Weaver can't believe it. Kamova can't believe it. She's decimated. There's confirmation. This year's women's all-around final. Jordan Weaver, world champion by 0 0.033. Ahead of Kamova. So Jordan Weaver takes gold in this women's all-around competition. The last world championships before the Olympics. Could well see those three up on the medal podium in London 2012. What order will they be in?